Welcome everyone to another video from Face Paint Forum Shop. Today we'll be painting a sugar skull, but we're gonna do it as cheek art. Yep, cheek art. I'm your artist rep, Lily Santoya, so let's get started. So here I'm using um, this gorgeous, gorgeous color. It's called a Dream Sickle, and you can find it at Face Paint Forum Shop. Uh, we're creating the skull here, right? The base. So I create that background with my sponge. And I just want to show you how gorgeous and vibrant this is. Oh, I love it. Alrighty, so I'll take a baby wipe and we're gonna create the skull shape. So I'm gonna go around it. Remember that the skull is wider on top than it is the bottom because of the chin. After you get your shape, go ahead and let that dry. Then I've loaded my little Crono round number three with Superstar Petrol Blue, which is one of my very favorites, of course. It's a really amazing replacement for black when you get tired of black line work. Just seems to go with everything. So here we're creating the eyes. Go ahead and make them a little big. And then we're gonna create the nasal cavity. We do this by stamping the tip of the brush down there we go so now we'll create the center piece for the forehead uh, we're gonna do this flower in line work that way we don't hide the gorgeous background color just making some petal shapes here you could even do a flower crown if you wanted on the sugar skull Now we'll create the outline of the skull. <clears throat> now the skull does have a deep cavity in the temple area as well as under the cheekbone. So anytime you're doing a skull, remember that. There's the deep cavity at the temple here up top and then right under the cheekbone. So we'll meet the chin together. I've reloaded and I'm gonna stamp the tip of my brush to create the teeth and the bottom row I decided to make it slightly smaller just to give it a little bit of uh, definition all right and <clears throat> as we all know sugar skulls are meant to be celebratory they're meant to be happy um, we're remembering our loved ones you know the good times the good memories so we definitely want to if we can uh, put some really beautiful line work and filigree in there so here I'm just doing teardrop swirls now if you don't have a lot of time and you've got a long line feel free to just use uh, face paint forum shops chunky glitter I'll be using it here in a second so here I'm adding some more teardrop swirls just going a little crazy with it um, there we go and we do that by uh, dragging and stamping it. So now I've got my Laura Cornell with uh, DFX Black actually and I'm putting dots around the eyes but I'm uh, varying them in size so some of the dots are going to be bigger. Now this gives the illusion that I worked really hard to get the detail in here. And of course, we're gonna put some dots here in the petals. And we're gonna give this sugar skull a smile. All right, I decided I wanted a deeper cavity in the eye. And you'll see why in a second. I've got my little Cornell round number three loaded with Superstar White. And here I'm just going around all the line work this is definitely an optional step. You don't have to do it. But here we're just having some fun. Now along with outlining the line work, I'm gonna add some dots of different sizes, varying sizes, right? Um, on the outside and the inside of the design. I stamped the tip of my brush to get the center of those eyes and you can see how much that popped right 
Now I'm stamping my brush again, just the tip of it to get petal shapes on the cheekbones. And we'll use a drag and drop technique to get teardrops up there by the flower. I'm gonna add some dots of different sizes as well within the design inside. Ooh, chunky glitter from Face Beam Form Shop. This is called Tiger Lily. So it comes to you dry. You're welcome to use Vaseline or chapstick to apply it. It's so beautiful. I use it all the time. Thank you guys so much for watching. So um, this rainbow cake is called Dream Sickle. You can find it at Face Paint Forum Shop along with everything else I used here in this video. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Viva Mexico!